This is Dr. David Harvey, and today I'll be demonstrating two ways to locally anesthetize the lower eyelid. In the first way, we directly inject into the palpebra conjunctiva as depicted here. We expose the uh, palpebra conjunctiva by gently stretching the lower eyelid inferiorly, and uh, note the um, stretching of the skin uh, as the uh, exposure is uh, gained. Typically, we'll inject about three to four millimeters below the actual um, gray line or where the eyelashes emanate from the tarsal plate. We bleb the local anesthetic and then slowly inject uh, into the mid portion of the palpebra conjunctiva. Note that I'm bracing my injection hand on the forehead with my little finger as a pivot while stretching the skin. This is very important to maintain stability and to avoid any sudden movements. Typically, we'll inject 2 to 2.5 cc's of local anesthetic, in this case, buffered lidocaine, very slowly. Sometimes one could add bupivacaine for an additional anesthetic benefit. The skin is remaining taut throughout the entire injection process. Uh, this again helps to ensure an even anesthetic delivery. And after injecting the bolus, we'll slowly remove the needle and then proceed to massage the anesthetic uh, as depicted here, a very elegant technique. On the second approach, we approach this laterally, going through a previous blub of local anesthetic. Sometimes I'll have already anesthetized the upper eyelid, and then we inject another two cc's of buffered lidocaine, again gently massaging. Two ways to numb the lower eyelid.